Good to see everyone again. I want to talk to you today about something that is not only fundamental, it's like this. You don't have a healthy relationship without it, period. And I'm going to talk to you about the issue of consent. Now, I know all of you have, are like, man, I heard consent so many times. And you know what? You should. And I'll tell you why. Because consent is the beginning of everything, and it's also the highest level of everything. Why are we asking for permission? Let's kind of back up. Why, are, why do we need to ask permission? We need to ask permission. Why? Because we want that person that we're with, that friend, that partner, that family member to know that, A, we respect them to the highest degree. When we're talking about consent, we're not only talking about agreement. What we're talking about is enthusiastic, yes, I want to do this. Let's roll. Let's ride. Let's get this popping. Let's make this happen. That's what we want when we talk about consent. And just remember, people can change their mind at any point, right? So let's say they start doing, let's say it starts off enthusiastic, like, yeah, I'm liking this. Let's do this. And as things start to get going, they're like, nah, hey, wait, you know what? Wait, hold on. I don't like this then guess what? Consent can be turned off and turned on at any point. Now, I know some of you are thinking like, that's not fair. But we're not talking about fair, right? We're talking about respect. And if you respect that person, then guess what? You want them to be enthusiastic, not only in the beginning, not only in the middle, but you want that enthusiasm all the way through that experience. Because guess what? If people are enthusiastic all through that experience, then odds are the next time around, they're going to be just as willing, if not even more, to participate. So just remember, when we're talking about consent, we're talking about permission, we're talking about respect, we're talking about enthusiastic, yes, let's do this, because ultimately what we're trying to communicate to the people who are in our sphere is that we respect them. We not only respect them, but we care about them. We value what they think. We value how they feel. And not only do we want them to do what we want to do, but we want them to do the things that they want to do. And when we talk about what is consent, the question always comes up like, well, what is a consent? Well, how about this? When someone tells you, no. So when someone says no, hey, man, that's pretty simple, right? No means no. How about this? How about maybe? Hey, a maybe is just a maybe, baby. It don't mean yes, it just means maybe. That means put it on the shelf, get back to it at another time. How about this? Physical indications like, mm, I don't know. So when someone ain't grooving, they ain't feeling it, hey, then guess what? Scratch that. Maybe a good thought might be the wrong time. How about this? Being under the influence of alcohol. I get this question all the time. Well, what have we both been drinking? Then guess what? We know that anyone under the influence of alcohol and drugs cannot consent at all. Period. Time out. Check back in later on when you sobered up. Then, if they make that decision, if they're enthusiastic about it, well then, hey, it is what it is at that point. And the last thing I want to talk to you is really is about developing what I call the language of respect. Because not only is it about the will you, do you mind, would you like to, yeah, those are all important. Those are like, yeah, that's how we talk. But you know, there's a lot more than just words, right? We're, we're looking for cues. We're looking for not only getting consent in the beginning, but we're looking about maintaining respect through any experience, right? So that comes with sensitivity, understanding who the people People are around you, how to really pick up on not only what their mouth is saying, but what their eyes are saying, what their body is displaying. And you'll get that as time goes by, but you'll never go wrong with establishing those basics. Would you like to? Would you mind? Would you join me? How would you like to go with me? Those type of things. You can never go wrong. And remember, consent is the highest expression, it is the beginning, and it is the height of any healthy relationship.